And now we're ready. So Zeb how the video listed as private. We're like, nobody's watching. <laughs> it happens like every 10th time. <laughs> Welcome to the Stay at Home Shopping Network. We are live in the shop. I reorganized the whole shop. We have aisles. I moved furniture around. We have some new clothes. We put out some new fall florals. So I'm super excited to show you the shop today and let you know what's new. Everything that you're going to get today is at jamierayvintagehome.com and Mariah is on and she is going to be dropping in the links as I show items or you could just search for the item in Jamie Ray Vintage Home and Zeb's just here to smile. I am, that's what I do now. You know, we paid for the new teeth and now I have to use them. Smile all the time. All right, so first <laughs> things first, I'm gonna show you that we got back in stock the galvanized metal scoop. These have been out of stock for probably four months. Every time that's I get long, them- That's a long time. Yes, every time I get them, they sell out. But good news is I kept ordering them over and over again to try to get them in. And now I have quite a few of these. Uh, so you never canceled any of those orders? No. <laughs> they're no. just like, yeah, they're back ordered still. You're like, oh, I'll just- I keep order. getting boxes and I'm like, oh, it's more, more scoops. $4.95 for this galvanized metal scoop. It looks really cute in potpourri. You can use it in your flour, your brown sugar. If you've got some big, things that you want to scoop or they just look really cute you could hang them from a tree with some fun you know for a farmhouse look so if you need ornaments we have two or 20 so look two those up or 20. 4.95 okay, i'll show you scoop. i'm gonna so i don't have my gimbal i did not realize we were going to be doing a shop tour i was at the farmhouse putting sheeting on top of the roof right before i got here so i'm gonna we're gonna bring things close and i'll do some pans of the room so you guys can get a sense of how things have changed all right well, you can show them the entryway here if you just want here, to. I'm just going to pan around. down so they can see your whole dough bowl full of scoops. We've also got the kitchen clothes. This heifer's had it. $8.95 for this darling little towel. And this is aisle two. Aisle one is actually over here. We have aisles now. We have aisles now. So if you guys recall, this gray shelving unit used to be on the back of the buffet. And I moved it over here because it's so much lighter and brighter. And we're getting, because it's winter time, I want more light. In the summer, I try to block these windows because they get really hot. Um, one of the new things that we did add to this was we put all of our hot pads in our chicken feeder. These are all made with authentic grain sacks and they're sold in pairs for $22.95. Some of them have, this one's really cute. What the Oh, just a little sign. It's all right. This one's really cute because it has the red and white striped back, so perfect for Christmas. Um, and this one is number 12. Thanks, Donna said it's a cute display. I tried to color scheme things. So when we did this display up here, I did the cute little grain sacks, which is the red and the blue. We've got our chippy baluster candlesticks. This is candlestick D. Like I'm in the way of all the stuff. It's $21.95 painted with milk paint. Look how good that is. Got a bunch of these. We made them with some new old stock and then Zeb cut bottoms out of salvage. And then because we've got the hot pads, I went ahead and put our little handmade scrubbies that Christy makes. These are $5.95 and they come in different colors. Oh, thanks, Kai. Um, and I put these next to the hot pads because I thought, why not? Did we have this last week? I feel like these have been gone too. No, well, we did have it last week, but it was somewhere else. You probably missed it. Yeah, then you know what? That's the thing about changing the shop up. It's like, oh, everything's fun and new to discover. Even Zeb's playing along with it. This one's $16.95 for the laundry like, oh. sign. <laughs> And then if you scroll, Zeb, you want to show them the bottom? Yeah, I'm, we're going to go flying. We have to do a little bit of flying. We have to do a little flying. Sorry, guys. Because of the way it's in there. I'll so try to be as smooth as possible. This display over here, we've got our little antique shoe molds. These are $11.95. Every single one is different. And it's kind of luck of the draw for these. These are really cute to display. They've got a lot of texture. I love shoe lasts. They're super cool. These are some of Zeb's favorite items. And then over here... We've redone the entry. We added, look. Oh, the pillows are done. Check out the back. So these are the mini pillows. They're all $9.95. We've got two of the barn quilts in the fall colors. This is the Royal River that Zeb did. And then we went ahead and added a few more pillows here that we got done. Christy got them all sewn for me. I did the stenciling on them. So, so cute. And then we added these, they're day dew picks. We've actually had them for a while, but we realized they look really great for fall. They're $3.95. This is in the floral section. We'll close the noisy door soon. Sorry. $3.95 for this pick. So this is perfect for fall. It's got the little nest, the browns, the greens. Looks really great, like with some amber and green glass that we carry on the website. And then I went ahead because I thought the bronze looked kind of fall. It matches my velvet pumpkins that we carry. 
I put this bronze shoe, it's $29.95. It's also like weapon grade, really, really heavy. Anything that's antique, you're going to find in antique, vintage, and found because they're one of a kind items. And then we've got a few of these pumpkins left. They've been going like crazy. The velvet is really popular this season. I ordered a little bit more of those. We'll get you go. These, are, these range in price from $14.95 for the small ones to $19.95. And the best part about these pumpkins is they've got this really great stem. That's, it's resin plastic, but it looks realistic. I searched high and low for good stems. What are these cups? I know they're not new. I remember thrifting them, but... So these are um, Royal they're, they're... Grafton Bone China, and they've got the tartan fabric on them with a hog with horns. I like how they mix the flowers, which are very delicate. Those are tusks. With tusks. This is $12.95 for the set here. So, and then we've got more of the mini pillows that we made. This one says witch and boo. These are new. We added the pine cone trees with the burlap base. $12.95. Got a ton of these. They're great for a transition from fall to Christmas because without anything on them, the coloring looks really great with like the rusty oranges. And then when Christmas comes around, you could change, add some ornaments or ribbon or whatever and make it more Christmassy. There's some red and black plaid. I had, Christy and I had to get in our, Christy's my uh, shipping home decor manager and she's like, no Christmas until October 1st. And I was like, can I please put the Christmas trees out? And she said, yes. All right, we redid this area over here. So I actually like the way that kind of flows around because no one ever sat at the bar but people will come and they'll put the they'll, they'll try the jewelry on and they'll say hey what's up in the mirror to themselves but we had a dresser here and people couldn't get up to the bar so we went ahead and we put these used to be underneath the checkout stand and I moved them over here we've got a ton of these towels in these are the little tassel towels that we sell I'm not reading comments I'll get back to them in a minute $6.95 for this one, the blue tassel towel. These are from Egypt. And then we have tons and tons of these are like a grain sack fabric. And this is red, blue, and gold. And these and are- Can you open it up and show them the whole size of it? Yeah, we've shown those like towels good. a lot, but I don't think we've actually shown how these big are they really are. a good size. Like you could almost make pillows out of those. Yes. And I can't remember the price. I think they're like $4.95 or $6.95. Is it not on them? Um, well, so we were running late and I told Jean to just shove- Oh, there it is. $5.95, so I was close. So $5.95 for these towels. And then this is the red stripe one, which is perfect for Christmas. It's also $5.95. It's square, 100% cotton. It's a grain sack fabric. And then they also come in the black stripe, which works for Christmas. Or if you've got like Halloween going on, I really like the black for that. Back when we used to do Pinner's Conference, I made about 150 of these and I think this is one of the few remaining candlesticks left that's like big like that you can almost use it like a pedestal yeah these chunky fat candlesticks these are on the website too they are uh, $24.95 they're listed as the painted fat candlestick and they have come in a few different colors but yeah you how many do we have any of those left except for that one we have that one and we have some green ones oh so. are like uh are they apothecary or are they um like pantry door um they are apothecary oh the cow this is what jen wants to see this is our cow cookie jar it's in the antique vintage found because it's only one item and it's 16.95 and it has a little bird on it is that what you wanted to see jen so the license plates we've sold we sold a bunch but the north carolina ones just haven't been going so i think if they don't make it past this run here we're going to go ahead and uh, cut the letters up and just make them like individual license plate metal letters. Yeah, we have quite a few of them left. They, every single one is listed individually with the state, so you can know exactly the one that you're getting. I like the coloring on these green ones. I thought they would be good for Christmas, so what I put I those out. What I might do is just like trim the North Carolina off and then do the letters separately and then also do like the 1974 separately. I don't know, we'll see. We'll see how I do it. Leslie says she's buying today. She sold her house and got the money. All right. Making it rain over there. All right, so these are our cloth napkins. We've got the ticking stripe. This is like a grain sack fabric. These are $8.95 each, and you can kind of get the idea for the size of them. They're All the napkins size. are pretty big. Yeah, they're good size. You can make pillows with them. They're ready for ribs. These ones are nice and textured <laughs> like a grain sack would be, which is why I bought them. We've got our false graph here. 
salt and pepper shaker and then we've also got the tarnished silver salt and pepper shaker if you look up tarnished silver you can find all of these items there and then false graph for all of the i don't think we've stoneware. shown the the serving spoons or anything like that before yeah we've got these listed on there um and they are silver serving utensils $6.95 for those? Um, I think they are, yeah, $6.95. They're, they're, they're pretty tarnished. They, I don't know that, I would just use them for display, I think, if it was me. One of the things we did when we organized all this is I put all of our paper napkins together. She's in aisle one. I'm in aisle one, and this is the napkin and paper plates. I'll come, I'll come get close up to your napkins and paper plates. Yeah. I just want to show them aisle one. Aisle I'm going to shut this door, too. If anybody needs farm animal paper plates, we've got them in big and small. And I want to show them this over here because I think sometimes people think when they're decorating for seasons, they can only have certain colors. Totally decorated for fall because we've got the velvet pumpkins, the pink, the white, and the emerald green. And then I put all of my pink right here. The whole display has changed. So I didn't have to get rid of the pink. I just added pumpkins in the colors that I've got. So I really think this now ties together very, very well. The big giant rooster looks good over here. We've got these bouquets are $26.95 and they've got the burlap around them. This is the Dahlia and Rose one. And then we've got a few different ones. I'm gonna show you one that's very fall when we get over there, but I put all the pink ones together and I just think the whole look is good. Put my pretty little butter dish over here. Um, the only thing we did to reorganize over here, we had to add an extra bath soap holder because I think we only have a couple of these left in stock. Yeah, they I didn't, are... uh, when you said you moved everything around in the shop, I was like, ah, did she move all the big furniture too? But she left a lot of the really well, big displays. Well, all this big furniture got moved, but not that one. But so it would we... be really hard to like push that over into the corner because the way we have these code ceilings in here, it, it just wouldn't fit good. Yeah. Um, Linnea says pink for sure is my jam, grandma chic is me, absolutely. So if you love pink, it's all about just finding those touches that say fall without having to change your whole color scheme. Also guys, we only have four of these primitive corbels left and my manufacturer is out. So if you've been waiting to get these primitive corbels, they're $29.95, you're gonna wanna get them now before they're gone. We've sold through all of them. This has mainly stayed the same. I put all of the canning jars together. We've got um, all the new hand soaps that just came in that smell so delicious. Our blackboard um, animals are back in. So we have our blackboard cow, pig, and chicken. These are $3.95 and you can actually ride on them with chalk is what they're made for, but I just think they're cute to display. So this is the uh, lavender water. What is it? Oh, lavender blossoms. It's linen water. Like you spray it on your linens and make them smell real good. Belinda, the big rooster is $89.95. And I think it's listed, Mariah, if you want to look it up, under Giant Rooster. It does have some authentic battle damage. We painted the battle damage. But right. I actually, I like that. I, I, I feel like it, uh, it adds character to things when they've got little chips and dings. And... All right, aisle two. Aisle two. We've got our buffet that people keep telling me not to paint, but nobody has purchased. And one of the days it's going to get painted. And what I did to redo this is I really kept it in clear glass, red, and gray. So we've got the gray birdhouse, the gray candlestick, carried over to the gray set of Kissing Angels. They're $19.95. And then I added a little greenery in our twin bucket caddy. It's $13.95 for this twin bucket cat or cat, what? caddy. And then I added these cute little day dew picks in here. These are the ones that are $3.95. And I just added some fall color and then I kept all clear glass up here and I just feel like the whole look is a little bit more cohesive. Before it was a little hodgepodge so I just put like items together. We've got our three French glasses for $14.95. Vintage ice bucket $7.95 and then this is pretty. This is cut glass apothecary. Is this cut or pressed? That does it have a seam. That's yes. how you that's like your go-to. If it has a seam. No that's not a seam. Maybe. Right. It looks like a seam. Is, and is it sharp? Well, it's listed as cut glass. I have no idea I, what it is. It's, I'm on the fence on it oh, there, because... That, no, that's not a that's seam. Not it's a sharp seam right there. Because it's sharper than this. This is pressed glass here. This is looking more like cut glass. Okay. It's well, not like sharp, like going to cut you sharp, but it, the ridges are all a little more pointed. We can neither confirm nor deny, but this is listed as the cut glass apothecary base, it's $14.95. Either way, it's beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. I would Sherry stuff that thing full candy. of candy corns right now. 
It depends. This is a medium clear jar with lid. These ones are $14.95. This is the glass canning jar with no lid. It's $9.95. Big mama jamma in the back. And if you need some cotton sprigs, we have, we, we have some of those. Large ball jar, no lid, $14.95. Ready to make your dough bowl centerpieces carry over into the winter season. We just have a few of the random old bottles that are $3.95 left in stock. So if you're wanting that. Wow, those little bottles really have gone. Yeah, people love getting them. Do you have any of the metal sheep that you have at your farmhouse? Those are sold out. Those are gone, gone, gone. All right, um, we've got our dough bowls here. These two are only in store. This one's like kind of wonky. So I have it marked down to 100. So I think we've had a bunch of people come in and look. They're just no, like... No, we sold two. Oh, okay. I just have a few that I bought of their similar size that are listed. We had some one. bonus ones downstairs. Yeah, I marked this one down to 100 though because we had to bring a new one out because this one doesn't sit super straight, so I'm not shipping that one. Um, and then this is new. We've got this is... Well, it's new in the store. $29.95 chicken feeder, rusty, and it's got the hooks to hang it. I put that there so it wouldn't fall over. And then we've got our unfinished balusters. We've got three different sizes. This is the $12.95 size. So if you want to make your own chippy candlesticks and you want them unfinished, we are selling them unfinished. And they are new old stock. So they're vintage balusters that were in some guy's garage since the 70s. And we scored a ton of them. So this is the um, tall and skinny which is 18 by two and a half inches, and it's 12.95. They also look really good painted up. I don't know if you guys watched, we had a bunch of like leftover chair legs and things like that that were broken that we painted up for a Waste Not Wednesday. It's probably been about a month now. So this would be so cute. Yeah. Painted in chippy milk paint and put sideways in a dough bowl. So if you've been looking for that, we've got- Yeah, I was gonna show you those, but I think they sold right they away. They sold right away. We've got our enamel section here. We added our lavender basket. I have one of these at the farmhouse. This is $69.95. It is my favorite lavender. And then we've got another one of the mini pills, pillows, pills. This is- Oh, uh, the nativity that's, one. Yeah, this nativity one. You know what? Not too much of that got uh, lost on the seam there. That's pretty good. So this clock is functional. It works. We don't keep it wound because it dings and chimes on the hour. And when people Gene are working like here in the shop, it, Gene doesn't love the chiming. It does have the key and it opens in the front. There's just a little clasp over here and then it's got the key there. But I think we've had this. It's been a little bit, but I don't think people know if it works or not. So I always like to let people know it's functional. It does work. Um, also, Coming into the fall, people are thinking centerpieces, so our 12-hole sugar molds, very popular for that. So dough bowls, if you've got a farm table that's really skinny, these are great. They also look really good on a mantle because they're nice, long, and skinny, so they fit the space. Then we have this chippy dresser. We actually did this. This was an experimental paint job that we messed around with and had quite a bit of fun with when it was a channel membership video, but I, I love the color. Almost all of it chipped off, and everybody's like, what is that weird green dresser? I'm like, Zeb likes green, okay? And it always looks good at Christmas time. If you guys have a store, one of the things I love to do is have things that people can pick through. So these antique keys are great for that because they're all different and people love to pick through and buy certain ones. Everything you see here is on the website. We've got our salt jar, our vintage ceramic boy and girl, so this is the end of this. I make kind of like an island. So this is the end of that island. So that's aisle two. That's aisle two. So we, you, I noticed you didn't move the big This stayed dresser. here, but we restaged it. So I moved up this Peach Luster Fire King. All these pieces are on the website because mint and this peach color look amazing together. And this is really a good fall color because you can see how it looks really great with this antique water jug and these wooden scoops that we sell. Together, those colors look good, like just kind of fall, but not like in your face orange. So I pieced that together and it also looks surprisingly good with the summer cottage mint color. So we've got that all together. And then these are the shelf corbels that we have, another day do pick, those are all over here. The handmade wooden scoops are 20 and I believe the antique water jugs are all unique. They're 26.95 for those. All right, so I also that looks like it's too high. Oh, there's one of those 
Uh, these look like they're um, Sweetie Jane. No, that's a potter. Is that apothecary? Mm -hmm. Yeah, those are the painted fat candlesticks. Oh, okay. And this is the fall signs that we stenciled with the JRV stencils. So we redid this. We just flipped it. So the dough bowls were on top, and all this little stuff was down on the bottom, and I felt like it was getting lost. So we put this big, long dough bowl that's $79.95, and then the old and gray dough bowls that are also $79.95 on top. And then I moved the little stuff up, and I think it looks better. So this is more like a little changing table, looks this like. This is a sofa table. A oh, sofa table. Yeah, See, sofa I would table. put like a changing pad in there for like a baby and put that in a nursery. I don't know if it's deep enough, but you could. Maybe. I don't um, know. It I looks added... about as deep as that one I made for Odelia. Yeah? Well, that was not, like, that was one that we made It was together. custom. <laughs> um, and we added these urns. I went ahead and kind of made this, like, if you guys are staging a store, we've got some height over here, and then it goes down. And then we've also got height coming up here. And this is just a great way to make people's eye. You really want it to bounce around from thing to thing so they can see all of the things. So this is urn with flowers is 1895. Oh, this is the ones that, these are the um, Dahlia and Hydrangea Market bouquet. This one I think is really fall. It's got like kind of the orangey leaves, the pretty like cranberry flowers, some berries, hydrangeas, and then these cute little fuzzy things. So we've got the little of fuzzy out. things. The little fuzzy things. I don't know. What are they? I don't know. They remind me of cattails, but I don't think that's what they are. Ivana, what is a dough bowl used for? So if you look up dough bowl on Pinterest, you'll see how people style them. They usually just put a bunch of home decor in them for the holidays. Um, lots of balls, pumpkins, greenery for Christmas. I do a lot of greenery in mine with a bunch of berry picks and sometimes Christmas tree coming out of it. You could put fruit in it. Um, and back in the day, people used them to raise their dough. The name, yeah, if you really want to, you could season it up and start making tons of bread. Make yourself some bread. Um, we added the white pumpkins here. Ooh, they're like all I said, together over here. Yeah, like out. I said, these pumpkins come in a bunch of different colors. You can really get them in whatever fits your design. This is aisle three. On the opposite side of aisle three, we've got a new island. Um, added some crates for height. We've got our brass and um, iron bucket planters here at $39.95. You can see that these have been welded. They're handmade, so each one is unique. And then we've got napkins. So these are sold in set of fours, and they are $26.95. These are the gray ones, and then these are beige? I don't know. They're in the same, same listing. And then we've got mice are popular this year. This is our little rat doorstop situation. It's not rat. It's mouse. mouse. It's a big, fat mouse, all right? Big, fat mouse. This is our big, is this the pick, dill pickle jar? But it's not, it didn't actually ever have pickles. But it's got the wire on it, and this one's $19.95, and they just put one of those cute Dahlia bouquets in it. It makes a really nice fall arrangement. Okay, we've got all kinds of new stuff arranged over here. We moved this desk. It used to be way over there, and it was hiding. It's a desk vanity. It's $95. Don't think we have it on the website. It would be quite a bit to ship, but I think the legs come off. So you could email Caitlin. I can and, confirm that right now. Let me look. Can you look in there? The legs do come off. Okay, so this could be shipped for probably about 50-ish dollars if you were interested because we can take the legs off and put it in a box. Um, this is fun because we used IOD and salt wash to cover a little bit of damage and now it looks adorable. I just piled on. It would look on. good with one of these mirrors you have back behind hanging yeah, we have up so above it mirrors. on the wall. Oh, there, oh, goes a, there goes the iron bird on the, the branch. The iron bird on a branch. Cute little bird. This one's bird like down. These are actual antique enamel... Um, bowls and they range in price from like 14 to 28 dollars depending on the size this is a new mirror where's that how big is that it looks like it's about 40 inches tall yeah it's 119.95 and it's got some great carving detail it's been painted i think white swan with clear wax these have been selling like crazy which is good because i bought 100 of them these are the set of four actual ceiling tins for 12.95 people have been buying them and making signs out of them we moved a larder up here and then more of these cute little um, They look good all bunched trees. together like that. Yep. And these these are so cute with, hold on, where are they? We have these mini signs. Jamie's bringing some signs Autumn over. Blessings mini signs. So look, this is what I was telling you. You can transition from fall to Christmas. See how cute that little mini sign is? These signs are 225, these little signs. And they look really great on wreaths or on trees or whatever. Are the windows new up there? I like them no, next to... No, I just moved them up there. I like them next to that sheep painting. Yeah, so these are new um, new up here, and they are 26, 28, 
$28.95 floral cut window. What happened to your 2015 vision? What? <laughs> That's really small tag. I couldn't read it. All right, so this is our island here. You guys see we added this. I made it flow a little bit better. And this is the dresser that used to be underneath the bar. Move down there. We've got yawning dolls. Anybody need a yawning doll? Another chicken feeder nested over here. This one's $49.95. And then these cute little mini um, cotton wreaths with the um, wood sprigs, $12.95. It's called a candle ring, but it's a big mamma jamma candle. <laughs> yeah, that's a lot of candles. Oh, how many candles that big? All right, so here's our the back side of aisle number three. This is part of the tarnished silver, but it has a D on it. So, and this little one is $12.95. These are more canning jars. Somebody was asking. These are 1995 Kerr self canning jar glass and metal lid. And then we've got this one. Also 1995. These little farm animal frames are like one of my favorite things. Yeah, these are really cute. This is the pig one. It's 595. And cow one hanging out up here. We've got our cute little buckets here that are the, the and then Primitive planters are $16.95. It's hard to tell because there's a bunch of stuff around it, but that is an old chest. Yep, this is $69.95. Legit old. It's got... Whoa! The cow down! The cow fell. <laughs> it's got the um, liner in it and then like cracks through it, but it's overall, it's like fairly clean for as old as it is. I didn't paint it. That's how it looked. Um, this is new. We added this piece that we finished the other day. This is the one we stenciled on Waste Not Wednesday. And then I just paired it up with all of our amber glass. So this is the large French amber medicine bottle. We, we actually brought, brought these back from France. Yep, that one's $19.95. There's a few things hanging hanging around that haven't gone. $9.95 for that one. If you're just tuning in, everything's at jamierayvintagehome.com. This is Christy's favorite towel. Plus the pizza before us, the breadsticks beside us, and the ranch between us, carbs, amen. $8.95. She said that more people need to buy it. So if you love carbs like we love carbs, that one's for you. <laughs> this is, amen, Chrissy just said amen. She's in the back talking. Okay, so, oh, uh, these are our column bases. And I just used it to put this amber jar, like a pedestal to like move it up. A lot of people ask us what we do with them. Can you see that okay? There's a lot of bright behind that window. I think they can. If you pitch it down a little bit, there you go. This is a great riser. And then amber is really popular for fall, and then we just put a day dew pick in it, and it makes a really cute little vignette. We have two aprons left. This is Grain Sack Apron H, and it's got Cincinnati Seamless on the side. And then we've got this one is E. Move our little mannequin out. And it's got the Baker Bemis. These are $49.95, made with authentic grain sacks. And they've got the crisscross tie in the back. Jane, Jean says, we got to get a tag on the table. We will. All right, we redid this area here. Some more of our cotton stems, another antique jug, and then these handmade wooden scoops that are $19.95. They're all different because they're all handmade. And then more of our dough bowls. We have dough bowls in every size, so that's pretty awesome. All right, half grain sack time. We have two half grain sacks this week. These are priced at, because I can't remember, $32.95. This is Grain Sack A. This is the half apron. It's got the blue tie, and Christy did something awesome. She actually sewed it top and bottom. I usually just do that. Hazel, um, the big dough bowls that are antique are from Europe, so somewhere in Europe. And then the handmade ones, I think they're made in Mexico. I'm not and sure. The handmade ones are from Mexico. The handmade ones are from Mexico. All right, so that is A. And then, Mariah, have you put, you can't find the half aprons? Let me see if Did maybe, you not make them live? Christy said she's looking. Yeah, it's possible we took them off because they were sold out. Um, yeah, it's not live. I'm gonna, while she's looking for that, I'm gonna go, so I, I gave you guys the shot of the shop from way out in the original but here's kind of like the pan if you were walking through it this is this is like my head height oh tripod watch out for that but you can move around and it flows pretty well now and everything like it's like a surprise it's like oh i didn't see that 
I, I gave the tour last week, and I was like, I don't remember all half of this stuff. Denise wants to know the <laughs> length of that chicken feeder. The length of the chicken feeder. I'm going to go out on a limb and guess 30 inches. Yeah, probably. Right Maybe. right around 30. It's Let almost a and it's almost a yardstick long. I'm going to grab a measuring tape real quick. It might be like 32 inches. All right, let's see if Zip, see how close you are. 32 inches, just shy of that, if you don't include this. <laughs> on the money. All right, Green Sacks are live. I just dropped the link. This is Green Sack B. This one is extra because Christy added the ticking stripe on the top and it comes with this patch was already on this piece. And so she left that on there. This one's really fun. It's Green Sack B. I love the patches. <laughs> yeah, they're the best part. These you just wear, you tie around the back like so. I'll wear this one for a little bit. Ta-da! We keep saying we're going to get some extra ones so we can wear them at the shop. This one has one big pocket, and Grain Sack A has two pockets. So, all right, I'm going to take this off. And the totes, are those, did you bring That's those back one. out? Oh, we have one that left. That is the last one, and it has all kinds of pumpkins. And it's free shipping on that tote. All right, so this tote, does it have a tag? Oh, it does. Price $18.95 for this tote, and it has pumpkins of all kinds, and it has all the different pumpkins, so this would be perfect for fall. And then, you guys, if you have been waiting for these metal roses, this is the last one $4.95. Wait, didn't we have a bunch last week? I know they all sold. We have one. <laughs> um, and then we have our locker tags, these are organized by number. This is smart if you guys have a store by the checkout, little things, because people will pick up a pair of sunglasses or a cute little bracelet. All of our jewelry is free shipping. These are $12.95 for those. And this little honeycomb necklace is $9.95. Oops, there we go. Putting it in camera. And then these are the metal heart discs, and these are $4.95. These are make cute ornaments, or you can tie them on a present or whatever. And the middle is brass. All right, let's go. Did we show everything? Oh, I was going to tell you guys. So the artisan handmade tags, I think sometimes people don't know what to do with them. But I wanted to show you how cute they are. Let's do, this is the rooster everyday tag, and this is the Halloween tag. But if you take them and you tie them on these little Christmas trees, I was going to do this before we went live. You can, pretty, you can pretty much do any of the tags on here. If I can get this on here. But it just adds a little like cutesy to them. You could also just add the R for rooster. And that's, that's another good way to transition like little Christmas trees for different seasons with these tags. All right, put those up. We'll go in the middle room. Did the middle room have this area over here? Yep, we had a few changes here. Looks like you left the hall tree there because it's like the perfect spot for oh, it. Oh yeah, I'm not moving that. We got $59.95 for these giant chippy candlesticks. Set Is that two. for both? Yes, for both. And then we've got our Ray Ranch cattle. This one is $59.95. Got a big old milk. It will not hold milk or water anymore. No, it's, it's been all arrested. rusty inside. Um, this is our French country bunny art, 1995 for this guy, antique frame, and then I did molds on it. And then these are always really popular. These are our, what are they called? Little, Farmer's Market and... The little tins? Yeah, five, they're five ninety nine five. Oh, this one, this one is tagged incorrectly. And way up high. Nine. Oh yeah, our little fall signs that Cameron made before we We've got the fall signs and also the conveyor, uh, like... Yes, the conveyor belt. What's that one? That's the two buckets for eighteen ninety five. dollars yeah. says. Those are really cute. You can put fall foliage, some Christmas decor in them, kind of industrial chic. And they're actually made from conveyor belts. And this is the dill wreath, $4.95 for this one. And then this is... Wait for it. This one is the... Baby grass, and this one's ten ninety five. Light green baby's grass. Babies, okay. Yeah, you got it. Close enough. All right. Do you have any questions, Seth? I I'm not looking at them. I'm I got the camera faced around looking at you. Oh, all right. Signs stenciled by Jamie. It's actually Seth did this one. Nineteen ninety five. We added this cute little beware pillow. It's twelve ninety five. 
This is new. That was from your friend exchange, right? Um, I, I don't actually know. So. I don't think so. Potted olive plant, $38.95. We added this in here for some greenery. I'm trying to think if there's anything else that's new in here. That looks like about it. Yeah, I think that's it. This is our product room. We have all, you guys, go to jamierayvintage.com. You can see all of the new fall 2020 stencils that came out. Also, if you did not get the email, the transfers, some of the transfers that have been out of stock, like Midnight Garden and whatnot, are back in stock today. So do not miss out on those if you've been waiting on those transfers. Okay, closing room. This is like Jamie's favorite room in here. So first we gotta show you Sheila. Sheila has a new outfit because she has transitioned from summer to fall. All clothes are free shipping on the website. This is a um, cardigan. That's cheetah, long leopard cardigan, 1995 for this cardigan. It's not super heavy, but it has pockets and it's nice and long if you're wearing leggings. And then she's wearing that cute black romper that I was wearing on Saturday. This is a great way to transition your like summer clothes into fall winter. You could even pair this with a long sleeve shirt. She's wearing her Utah necklace. Do you have other ones or just Utah? You just have Utah, because it's Utah. She's wearing Utah. She's wearing Utah. Um, and then she's carrying her cute little purse. This is the um, eyelid purse, I think. This one's 1895. It's a zippered bag. And it's free shipping on the purse as well. And then it's got like one little pocket in there. Pro tip, if you're selling purses, stuff them with paper because they look better. All right, we're going to give Sheila her bag back. We reorganized this. I added the Donkey Serape shirt because one of my favorites our graphic tee situations and then we got three new shirts in the one that I'm wearing this is the tie knit top and then we've got the boho top burgundy boho these are both $19.95 with free shipping so these are really well priced this one is just kind of like a three-quarter length kind of balloon type arms and I like this shirt because it's flowy so if you've had a few children or an extra burrito, nobody needs to know. And these are, you want to show my new jeans? I have lots so of extra I wear burritos. Jeans without holes in the winter. These are junior size. So normally I wear like a 6'8 and these are 11s, just to give you an idea of these. Because they, anything that's sized in odd numbers is juniors. But we also got some new... Well, I'll fix it later. We got some new plus size jeans. Last time we had these in, they sold out. Thanks, cobwebs. I should get shirts with pockets. Oh, we have some. I'll show you. All right, so these are our new plus size. These are like a dark gray black wash, and they have no holes in them, and they come in 1X, 2X, and 3X. They're skinny fit, and they're 34 length, so nice and long. Do they have any stretch to them? Oh, yeah. They're just like these. These are nice, stretchy, and I'm wearing these with my new boots. We got new boots in. I love the invention of the stretch denim because I can't wear pants without stretch denim anymore ever again. So these are the boots I'm wearing. Really good quality. They come in. Renee wants to know the jeans are, sorry. I don't, Christy didn't price them. I don't know, let's see, did Mariah find them? Mariah, how much are the jeans? Did you find Some of those? this is stuff is brand new put out today, so it doesn't have tags yeah, on like it in the shop. It like, like it came it came in and they got it out right before the video. <laughs> oh, the plus size. If you've been needing leggings, we have the leggings. Those are joggers. Those are joggers. It says leggings depot right on them. I don't know that Christy put it. those in. Christy? I, I'm not finding the plus jeans. They're on. Right. Well, I, no, I'm finding them. I'm not finding them on the website. They're called plus uh, skinny hold, please. Hold, please. We will find them, Renee, and then we'll get back to the other. If they look back at the things boots. as uh, and sort by newly added, they'll find all of the plus size high rise skinny jeans. All right, they weren't tagged as jeans. Plus jeans size today. high rise skinny jeans. Twenty nine ninety five. Oops. Why is the three X priced differently? I'll fix it. Done. Fixing Done. it on the fly. $29.95 oh. for these jeans. Super comfy, but they are 34, so 
You're gonna need to be tall. All right. Plus let's bonus, get back. a basket of cats. Brain sack cats. We still have five left, so check them out on the website. Okay, back to these boots. They're twenty six ninety five. I'm wearing the black ones. You want to show them? My skinny jeans. They are suede. I'm wearing a size eight, and I wear a size eight in Nikes. So that gives you an idea of fit. I say they're true to size. They're kind of dressy. You look a little casual, but it also looks like you could go somewhere nice for dinner. Yeah, and you could wear these with a skirt for sure. And they come in this color. And then also I bought them in brown because I always like to have both options. $26.95, really just well made. In. The brand is Soda. So if you've ever bought from a lot of boutiques, nice zippers on them. You gotta have both colors. You can't get locked into the yeah, black gang. Free shipping. So for $26.95 and free shipping, these are bomb. Also, these are $39.95. We just brought out the furry boots. We've actually had these on the website for a while, but we did not bring them out. I have a pair of these, and I had to size up to a 9. So what do you size normally up wear? An 8. So just one size but up. These, the reason why these boots are awesome is I want you to look at the bottom. Whenever you guys... Tall is 38-inch seam. Oh, sorry, Elaine. Thir 38 is tall. Well, 34, I held them up, and they went to, like, here. <laughs> so I thought 34 was pretty tall, but I'm kind of short. Um, anyways, these, whenever you find these boots, even the Uggs, they have those slick bottoms, which I think is super dumb because these are made for the snow. These ones have grip. Let's be honest. You're not going to go tromping in the snow. That's to get you to the car. Yeah, and I don't want to slip on my way to the car. <laughs> so all these are our new boots that we've got in. This this is a new dress that just came in. Kind of a boho style dress, $24.95. Here, go, st go stand over there and hold it up to you. Oh, $24.95 for this dress. And it's teal. It's just down to the knee. It's got this really cute lace detail on the top and these gold buttons. And it comes with an extra button. No extra charge for the button. And I think those come in small, medium, and large. And this top, just to give you an idea, I'm wearing a small. So I think this is like very generously sized. It's got lots of space in it. Um, these are new. Christy, did we get the new girl shirts on the website? So if you have little girls, this is the kids ribbon sleeve floral top, $22.95. And it's got the cutest little sleeve detail. I'm always trying to find inexpensive girls clothes because boutique clothes for little girls are expensive. But if you've got a little girl, this top is perfect for fall and it's super, super soft. So. It's a good one. Um, we redid the mannequin with this new sweater. So I the sweater. Is it soft? Mm-hmm. Oh, it is soft. This shirt does not come in plus sizes. I try to get plus sizes when I can, but this one didn't come in it. All right. I don't remember how much that one is, but I really, I remember it was pretty inexpensive. Hold on, let me see if I can find it. Sorry. Can you guys see the whole shirt? $26.95. $26.95. So I would call it a sweater almost. Yeah. I'm going to show all the sweaters because we haven't shown them in a while. This is the cable knit sweater. This one is $33.95. I wore this on my birthday because it was cold. It was cold on your it's birthday. It's teal colored. This sweater, so soft. $32.95. It's a leopard cardigan. I like you. I have that one too. I noticed you brought some hoodies in. Yeah, so you were asking about shirts. These, these, this Eliza liked the peach lily one. This one is eighteen ninety five, but then these are the big, mama jamma hoodies, kind of boxy. Little heavier duty. Heavier duty, and they are twenty four ninety five. They're oversized hoodies. So those are pretty awesome. I'm trying to think what else we brought out. Is that a rust color? Is that what we're calling this? Yeah, we've this? got this. Well, I don't know what. What did Christy call this one? We've got other boots, so don't leave. Fired brick. Fired so, brick. Close. And then also, we've got this one. So this one's a little bit different. This one has kind of a, a cowl neck, which I think is a little bit more either like mature option. And does it have pockets? No pockets on this one. This is the black cowl neck hoodie. It's $18.95. But this cowl neck is really flattering on. So instead of like the juvenile kind of V-neck, this is just a little bit more of an adult hoodie. And I like how the sleeves are kind of blo blossom, blossom. What'd you say? They kind of, you know. They flare out. I yeah. don't know. Whatever. <laughs> You're asking the, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a t-shirts and shorts guy until it's too cold and then I go t-shirts and jeans. So we've got those over here. <laughs> this one, this is a shirt I was wearing a few weeks ago. This is the Slate Bohemian shirt, $26.95. That one's really, really cute. 
Um, and then we've got new boots. Oh, new boots. Hold on. We'll wait, get boots in a minute. wait for it. These are so soft. The striped long sleeve, twenty six ninety five for that one. Wait for it. For fall, this is striped shirt with accent pocket, also twenty six ninety five. So similar, except for this one has a round neck and a accent pocket. And then is the this, other one a V? This V also comes or like in a scoop, gray and a scoop white. Neck. And it's not Angora. Angora makes me itch, but it's soft like Angora, which is rabbit hair. So who wants that? And then this is also really cute. It's the floral color block shirt, $22.95. Nice and flowy in here. And then the sleeves are just really soft and warm. Brought that one out. This is another one, great for fall. We've got the long, super, super soft sleeves. This, where's the tag on this? Where's the tag? Christy put it out without a tag. Well, you have to find it on the website. It's time to go hunting. Time to go hunting on the clothes. Okay, let's move around this way. Show okay. the new boots. Also new boots, $26.95. I'm coming this way. They're suede. How much are they? I was a long way away. $26.95. That's Ooh, the wrong app. Hold on. Tassels. Yeah, these ones are way cute. Hold on. Let's see. Colleen says, um, love how you use the chairs to hang clothes. Are the boots suede? They are suede feeling, but they are man-made. For $26.95, you're probably not going to get a real dead animal, so we've got the fake. But it is a suede feel on all the boots. So this one is fringe on the side. You only can unzip this side. I'm just telling you that because when I tried to put them on, I tried to unzip this side. This is just for looksies, but it does unzip, like, let me see if I can move the fringe out of the way. It does unzip a little bit, so if you have a slightly bigger calf, it actually has like a little bit of fabric in here. So that way they can open up and it also has cute little toe. I was gonna stop wear these cause I love them, but I have not painted my toenails. So I didn't buy them. These are cute little taller heel on these ones. And these come in this brown color and then also with black. So cute with skinny jeans, but also I feel like because of the fringe they're kind of dressy, these would be great with a dress. So these are $26.95 in black and in the brown which is a smoking deal, especially with free shipping. So I'm all excited about our new fall boots that we got in. Um, these are size the same. I wear a size eight in these. I wear a size eight in Nikes, just to give you an idea. All right, let's see. Velasquez says, love that style with toes out. Thanks, cobweb. Oh, joggers, they do run true to size. Did you guys see the plus size joggers? I, sh I we panned over them and I call them leggings. Yeah, <laughs> I forgot. So these are new. These are the black camo joggers, so black and gray in the plus size. Ironically, you know, sometimes I order plus size and it doesn't show up. And then this time I ordered plus and regular and only one new regular style came. So, um, and fun fact, if you wear an extra large, you can wear a 1X in the plus size. Our extra larges always sell out super, super fast. So don't be afraid to just buy a 1X. We have one of our regulars. She's bought both and said that they fit interchangeably. So that is new. We got more of the camo. More of these ones have been so popular. We have these in. Those are those sizes. are Jamie's traveling pants. Yeah, I wore these to California. They have kind of a rust. They're actually color called uh, red rose, but I would say rust. Super soft. These. Well, and they have the cuffs on the bottom, right? Pockets and cuffs, so they don't cut off your circulation. That's important. And then we have, these are brand new. These are the blue flower ones, also plus size, also pockets, also cuffs. And then I'll show you the new, um, the new reg. We only got one new pair of regular size. These are the lilac floral ones. Jean already got a pair. And these only come up to an extra large. So small to extra large in these. Joggers are money. They are so comfortable. And I like them better than leggings because I feel like they're not showing every ounce of my body. <laughs> but they're still soft <laughs> and comfortable. And they can they transition from casual wear to pajamas. Also important in my life. Y'all know I like to be comfortable. They don't um, show that you did have that extra burrito this morning? <laughs> If you guys are wanting some of the Day of the Dead ones, we still have a few of these left. Perfect for Halloween. Say it in Spanish for me. 
Dia de los Muertos. Thank you. <laughs> I'm wearing, oh, Cobweb is wearing my joggers right now. Yeah, they, I always, we get emails all the time. Did you guys get new styles in? So if you don't love joggers, we also have pajama pants in the similar fabric that are straight legs. And those. But and nice they're, they're big and wide in the legs. My mom says she doesn't like the joggers. She likes pajama pants. So we have both. We have tons. We have such a, Christy's like, I feel like you have a shopping problem. I'm like, uh, I just like clothes. So when I want to buy something new, I just buy it wholesale. All right. Um, last but not least, we added beanies to the website. You'll notice there is only one purple one. Who do you think got the other purple one? That's a sparkly purple. Yeah, this has a little bit of glitter in it. Um, and it is $24.95 for this one with the pom-pom, the CC beanie. The white one almost looks like it's like a pearl. It's, oh, so it's the gray. white has the silver glitter in that. And then we carry, I already have one of these home. Eliza steals it all the time. These ones are $19.95 for the mint CC beanies because this one doesn't have the pom-pom. And then we've just got like the nice classic black. So these are really soft, really comfortable. CC beanies are known for their quality, which is really important to me. And I just tried to get some fun colors. So we added those. I'm trying to think if there's anything. I think that's all it. So. I think everything else they've seen, the purses up there, we still got a few oh, of those left. I haven't I shown this one in a while. This is the paint splatter sweatshirt. These are Does it hide the real paint splatter? I feel like it's busy enough that it could. This one's really, really soft. Can you feel how soft it is? Feel it like. is soft. $29.95 for that one. Here's the sweatshirt I was wearing. Oh, no. Is that? This is the one I was wearing yesterday. See beauty in everyone. I don't know if you guys know this, but Jamie has a sweatshirt problem. She has more sweatshirts than she has actual shirts. And we have to have like a special place in the house to store them. Also $29.95. <laughs> um, because once 50... it gets a little chilly, she does not want to risk being cold. No. And, and she won't do it. We have weird weather. So you have to wear a shirt with like a sweatshirt or a sweater over the top. So that way when it warms up, you can take it off. And then when it cools down, you can put it back on. Also, if you live places where you don't have a lot of cold weather, we still have a ton of bathing suits, shorts tank tops, t-shirts. We're going to keep those up year round because I know that not everybody lives here. So I don't want to assume that you've got cold weather. So definitely check those out if you need them. Although the natives in Southern Arizona and in Florida probably think that 60 degrees is freezing. Probably. My sister Renee does. She's on here. Oh, we got a new garland. It fell down. It keeps falling. I know. This is the, oh, don't fall off. This is the, ooh. There we go. I, I think I got it. Can't get the tag. Glitter frosted eucalyptus garland. It's $24.95. Eucalyptus always reminds me of driving on the freeways in California. And it's a little bit glittery, but I feel like I it feel won't like it, it won't hang. Just just let it go. We go. We'll put it up later. The hooks the nails need to be angled up. <laughs> They're Anyways, like angled I down. I feel like that transition. Where did I put my phone? I always lose my phone. I don't know. It's because you set it down to like show. Oh, it's right here. Okay. Oh, See if there's oh, any yeah. comments before we go. Oh yeah, you guys, I get asked oh, about pan. my pearls I wear all the time. They're $8.95 for like 16 of them. A really good deal. We also sell the rhinestone earrings that I wear. All right, I think that that's it. I hope you guys like our reorganized shop, our new clothes, our holiday decor. Um, make sure you're hitting up jamierayvintagehome.com. And if you want paint and products, then that's at jamierayvintage.com. Be sure to give us a thumbs up and subscribe to Jamie Ray Vintage for more. DIY and closing room. Cobweb says cyber shopping is her jam because she does not like shopping in real life. Jamie does need a sweatshirt intervention. Ivana, <laughs> don't judge me. And also, guys, stay tuned. Next week, I'm cleaning out my closet, and I'm going to offer some once or twice worn items because I get everything we get, I pretty much like it all. So then I take it home, but now I've ran out of hangers. So I thought maybe I'll we bought several some items. So there's been several runs on hangers and there's still no room to closet. It's, it's true. So next closet's week, running out. if you're in like a small medium, Mariah I'll says just send those to her. Oh, well, I'll send you pictures first, Em. All right, guys, uh, we guys. will catch you later. Thanks for joining.